It is a pleasure that you are with me again. I hope you and your pet are well. Today we will talk about the following. If a dog is lost, can it find its way home? Let's start. There are many amazing and heartwarming stories about how certain dogs can find their way back home after getting lost on a trip or straying too far from where they live. But the question is, how do they do it? Do dogs have a good sense of direction like some people? Do they navigate by looking at the stars like sailors of the past, or do they have a well-developed internal compass? Are they in tune with the magnetic fields of the Earth? Although there is no research on the searching ability of dogs, it is speculated that dogs probably rely on two of their five canine senses, sight and smell. 1. Smell markers and sense of smell in dogs. The sense of smell of dogs is more developed than the sense of smell of humans without a doubt. Dogs have more olfactory neurons than humans, between 220 and 2 billion, compared to a measly 12 to 40 million that we humans have. Every time you take your dog for a walk around your neighborhood, he becomes more familiar with the distinctive sights, sounds, and smells of your home and the streets around you. And every time your dog takes a step, he leaves behind a distinctive scent with his paw pads. Each of these scent deposits your dog leaves behind creates a larger chemical signal that essentially tells him, I was here. If you walk the same paths over and over again, you renew the scent markers on your path and probably pick up other scent markers left behind by other people and animals, which can help you with your orientation. 2. The dog's visual acuity and visual markers. In your constant walks, you may have noticed that your dog does not walk with his nose to the ground all the time. While there are a ton of delicious scents for his sensitive nose to pick up on his way, he can also be looking around, visually orienting himself. This helps dogs create a mental map of their visual environment. Research on wolves has indicated that they use visual landmarks so you can guide your way through their territory. Researchers have also discovered that some wolves have taken shortcuts to get from one point to another. Although a dog's visual acuity is three to four times worse than that of humans, they can still recognize and remember visual cues that they may find significant. For example, when I walk my dog down my street after exploring our local neighborhood, he gets more animated as he gets closer to our house. When I let go of the dog's leash, he made it to the front door on his own. If I try to walk past the house when he's tired and wants to come in, he pulls on the leash to tell me where he wanted to go, which is home. I wonder, what does my dog find out? Do you recognize the sight of the house or the smells that our feet and paws have left behind? It's probably a combination of both. 3. Maximize your chances of your dog finding his way home. After highlighting the wonderful senses our dogs have, let's not forget that in reality, many pets are lost each year and never make it home. Whether they were picked up by other people, had a tragic accident on their way home, or can't find their way through their dog's senses, the chances of them making it home safely are slim. The best chance you have of reuniting with your dog if he ever gets lost is to make sure he has a microchip and ID tag and a dog collar, this can help a lot. Develop your dog's hidden intelligence to eliminate misbehavior and create the well-behaved, obedient pet of your dreams. Hit the instant access button below now. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, comment, and share the video, thanks.